Hey, what's up everyone? It's Bruno here. And uh, you know, I get a lot of questions about things uh, about Big Brother, like, uh, you know, uh, did you get to keep anything from in the house? Do you have any memorabilia? Uh, things like that. So I figured, you know what, why not make a video and I can show you guys exactly what I got to bring home with me from season three and again uh, from season five. So that being said, let's get started. So on season three, um, there was a few things I got to bring home. Uh, one of them is this uh, beautiful magnet. It's huge, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I do actually put it on my fridge. Uh, my wife actually put it there. But yeah, just a big magnet on my face. Uh, yeah. Um, also, we got some mugs. Um, I don't know, to be honest with you, I don't know if I got this mug because I won HOH or if everyone got the uh, HOH mug. That I couldn't tell you, but I do have an HOH mug. I do have a Power of Veto mug. And I do have a mug with my name on it. So I did win a power of veto in season three and an HOH. Again, I don't know if that's why I got both or if everyone got them, but I do have both plus the mug. Another thing I got was um, we did a challenge. If you remember, uh, Sarah Hanlon pretended she was sick. Um, then we got to watch a movie or a television show. And uh, anyway, we had to play out something from, uh, we got to dress up as doctors and everything or from the I think it was called Bethune Hospital, something like that. Anyway, uh, this was my name tag from my suit um, that I got to wear. So we got to keep that, just a little keepsake. And it has just a little bit of stuff on the back. Nothing too crazy, but uh, my name tag. Another thing I got to keep, my Vito chip. So this is the season three Vito chip. Um, as you can see, it is the shape of a gear. My name actually only got picked once, I believe. And that was during the triple eviction, and it's the one that I actually won. So, um, yeah, this is the one time I got picked, and it was a big one for me, because I believe I could have got home that week. Another thing we got was this. I think it's a keychain or something. It's just a big brother uh, key. You know, because when we do get um, put into the house or we do find out we're in the house, we don't get keys and we don't have keys in the house like the Americans do or whatever. Um, so this is what I got. Just a key. It says Big Brother on it. Pretty cool. Um, as you can see, I've never opened it before. So this is two years later, <laughs> but it is pretty cool. And uh, yeah, neat little keepsake. So also, this wasn't actually part of the show. Um, a company did make this for me after, but you know what, I, I like it and uh, I like it so much. And it's a sweater that I used to wear um, a lot in the house. So you might recognize that on season three. So I got my own little bobblehead, which is kind of cool. Uh, pretty, pretty cool. And it's, yeah, my Italy sweater, the one that I wore a lot in the house. You know, my wife, the second time I played, she said, you're not bringing that sweater and you better change your clothes more often because all I wore was that Italy sweater and that Canada sweater. So she said, you make sure you wear all different clothes this season. And she would not let me bring that sweater as much as I wanted to bring it. So there's my bobblehead from season three. Pretty cool, huh? All right, so that's season three. Um, yeah, that's everything that they gave me and um, that's that. So moving on to season five. So in season five, um, I actually have two veto chips. I don't know why. I don't know why we got two, but there's one. I remember there was a, there was a reason. I think this one was picked for something else. It wasn't exactly a veto chip, I don't think. But anyway, so that's my veto chip. One and two. Um, also, I actually took these from the studio, but these are the slop cookies. If you remember, Gary got 48 of these bad boys. I got none, and I ended up being on slop because of backwards week. So I have three of them. Three slop chips, which weren't actually given to me. I may have taken them, but uh, yeah, I have three of them. Also, um, everybody in the house got these. Um, if you remember, it was the first veto ceremony, or sorry, the, the first veto competition. And I actually won this one. This is the veto that I won. 
and it was called Me Want Vito. And we had to run and get these tiles, bring them back to uh, where we started, and we had to put together a puzzle. Uh, what was it? It was um, Dig Your Own Cave. So that was the answer to that puzzle. But what they gave us was um, puzzle pieces with our initials. So I am Bruno Aiello, B-I or B-I, right? So um, they gave me those with an extra one. So what they didn't show on the show is uh, one thing was, you see, like, I'll use this as an example, okay? So there would be about two or three tiles that look just like this or pretty close to it. But let's say he would have two teeth instead of one, te one tooth or maybe his hair was black or whatever. Maybe he had two bones in his hair. So it was very hard to get the right piece. You had to really make sure before you ran back that it was the, the right one to bring back. And if it wasn't the right one, you would never be able to figure out the puzzle. So it was a lot harder than it looked. Um, that's a little something that I'm sure a lot of you didn't know. But anyway, um, yeah, these are the puzzle pieces. So this is season five. Another thing I got was uh, my name tag. It's pretty cool. Little banner. It says my name. And this is something else that I took. It's, oh no, this isn't what I took. No, this was a uh, nomination. So the biggest baby, I was nominated for the biggest baby. Um, it's actually, it goes together with these slop cookies. When I was put on slop for two weeks in a row. Guess who won? Me. Yep, I won the biggest baby award. It's, uh, if you remember, it's when I went and kicked my bag a few times. Yeah, I wasn't too happy. You know, uh, people don't understand how bad slop is. It's very um, underrated, I find, uh, of how big of a game changer it could be. I'll tell you, I'll just get into it actually a little bit. Um, you know, slop is, um, it, it, it definitely takes a lot out of you. It, this is a social game. Big Brother is a social game, a game where you have to talk to people, you have to stay in the loop, uh, you have to have energy, you gotta, you gotta be, you know, you gotta be right in there socially and everything. And when you're on slop, you're kind of agitated a little bit, you're drained, you don't have a lot of energy, and you just don't wanna talk to people. You kinda wanna keep to yourself a little bit. And, uh, you know, I did two weeks in a row on that and I felt uh, it was kind of, uh, it definitely was affecting my game because I wasn't maintaining a lot of relationships and stuff. So slop is a bigger factor than I think the game lets on and that it shows to the audience. And, uh, you know, again, you guys see three hours a week. We're living at 24 hours a day when we're in there and you're hungry, you know, and... Uh, you know, just try, I don't recommend doing it, but you know, think, just think of yourself, you know, you haven't eaten for a day or something and how hungry you are. You know, people say they get hangry and they're agitated. Try doing that for two weeks. And uh, you know, it's, it's, it's really tough. And the fact that you're smelling people cooking, you know, steaks and uh, bacon or shrimp or whatever you like, the foods that you like, burgers, whatever it is, and you're stuck there eating this stuff and it tastes horrible. Uh, it tastes like sand, it has that texture, it's just, it's horrible. Uh, it's definitely not oatmeal. A lot of people think it's oatmeal. It's definitely not oatmeal. And, uh, you know, uh, again, I just, um, yeah, people just don't get that, how, um, how much that it really affects your game. So I just wanted to get that out there. Um, but anyway, that's all the stuff. That's everything. So you see bobblehead, couple mugs, veto mug, HOH mug, a mug with my name, a key, my season three veto chip. Biggest baby, that's me. My name. The veto um, tablets or chips, I don't know what you call it, but I won. Another one. My season five veto chips. And the slop cookies that I stole. Another thing that I took that I didn't bring up here was uh, the jury letter. When we had that jury letter saying uh, when Dylan came in and um, said he had the big news that we got to see the uh, a minute clip from the house guests that were remaining in the house. I think it was the final three or four. I don't remember now. But anyway, I actually took that letter too. So I have that. I didn't bring it uh, up here today, but uh, I do have that as well. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Um, just a little something and nothing too crazy. Just a little something of what I got to bring home with me. And uh, yeah, just uh, add to my little collection. So anyway, um, you know, sub to the channel, click like. If you have any questions, you know, drop them down, write it down. And uh, yeah, I'll try to get to them and answer everything. So anyway, thanks for checking it out. Have a good one, guys. And, uh, you know, be safe.